Hello gamers! Today I'm making a different video than usual. It's not a food review or a drink review, it's insane. It's more YouTube content. Now, I don't know if you know this, but this is a real, this is my real background. Like this is, I can go back there and touch things. That's not a green screen. Not that anyone would even think that's a green screen. I don't have the money for that. But it's actually, I'm making a video about Hot Wheels. You've seen them in the thumbnail, so let's just, just get to it. It's these ones, right there. I'm falling over. Also, this isn't just one Hot Wheels car. There, there's like rows of them. They go back. Look, and there's another one, and then there's another one. There's four of them, at least in this row. The other rows have, I think, most that each row has is four. Most of them have two, but. I've been wanting to make this video for a while now. I just never have because I keep forgetting about it, even though I literally sleep right underneath them. So, these are actually Braille Hot Wheels cars. If you look, they have nubs on them. And on the car themselves, they have nubs on the car themselves. I actually, I have two of these white ones. One so I could open it, and then this one so I could keep it in the package because it has the nubs. But... I got this one first, and then I saw this one maybe a few days after I got the white one. Then a few months go by and they come out with this red one. Then a few months later they come out with this green one. Now, I understand, you know, it's really cool. The Hot Wheels car, it's got braille on it, so you know, like a blind person could be like, hey, this car, I know what the name of this car is, even though they can't really see it. I mean, obviously they can feel it. They're like, all right, this car is the, the twin mill. That's what it's called, at least. Yeah, this is the, the twin mill because it's got two engines. Wow, insane. Um, and I believe the packaging says Hot Wheels twin mill. I'm not 100% sure. On either side of the car, one side says twin, one side says mill. That's what it says on the back. Now, we're going to get to the reason I'm making this video. Braille is for blind people, people who cannot see. And I understand it's really cool. You know, now we can, you know, support blind people, you know, playing with Hot Wheels, which is pretty neat. And I ain't, I'm not saying there's nothing bad about that. This one, this one specifically, it says that the National Federation of the Blind, it's the first one they made, it's the white one. It even says new for 2023 on it. This gray one, it, it has, or silver one, it just has new for 2023, and it's just silver. Sorry, I'm getting distracted. The point of this video, people who use Braille are blind, meaning they cannot see. Now, if you cannot see, that implies the color of the car does not matter. So why are there four different colors? for a car that's intended for blind people. I understand, obviously, that, you know, I'm the reason there are four different colors. But if it's made for blind people, why is it, why is it different colors? Now I'm thinking, this is just my thoughts, and I at least I understand it to an extent, but I've never looked into it. I've never done anything. This one is the white one because it's the first one that was made as an official collaboration with that Federation of Blind People. So it's all white because it's a nice, clean, simple car. This one, I believe, is silver because Hot Wheels may have seen this one was selling good. So they're like, why don't we just make one that's not even painted. It's got a stripe down it, but there's no point even having that stripe, but it's it's not painted. It's just silver. These ones are red and green in my thinking theory because red and green are the most common colors to get mixed up when you are colorblind. So it is my in my professional opinion, these were made to support colorblindness rather than real blindness. But that's just a theory. Also, uh, uh, these two are under the Hot Wheels Experimental 
uh, experimotors, which means they're like experiments. There's something that's different. It's not just a normal, it's not just a normal Hot Wheels car. Like, like the, actually this one might be an experimental because this one's a fidget spinner. But it's just a normal Hot Wheels car, like this truck here. It's just whatever. They're experiments. They're different. These ones are actually under Hot Wheels Celebration Racers. And on the back, it says holiday-themed vehicles. So I don't know what holiday these are for, but... I don't know. I just wanted to make a video to point out the fact that there are cars for blind people, but they come in four different colors, and I'm expecting a yellow or blue one of these to come out at some point. It, it just makes sense. I mean, I buy them, obviously. I'm stupid. I mean, look. And I have two boxes full of Hot Wheels on my left here. Like, here. Just... I don't know if you can... This is full of unopened ones. That one's full of opened ones. And these here are old Matchbox cars from my uncle. And obviously I got Hot Wheels cars on the shelf beside me as well. I got Hot Wheels cars back there. I got Hot Wheels cars in a bin in my closet. Got them all over the place. I just wanted to make a video. Why... But a blind people want four different colors of car if they cannot see the colors. I don't get it. I assume it's color blindness, and this one's because there was a market for them. That's all I got. Anyway, that's it. Thanks for watching. Stay crusty, my boogers.